Conditions out there in Acadiana. Thank you. Good info over there, Rob. We appreciate it. Let's check in with Hunter Davis tonight. She's in New Iberia. Hunter. We are near the intersection of Daspit and Troy, where a down power line has caused outages in the neighborhood for a little over an hour now. I want to show you guys kind of what we have going on here. This power line is blocking off not one, but two roads. You can see some vehicles still able to travel the route because the power line is not live. However, some vehicles opting to turn around once they get to this point. I want to show you guys the tree that caused all of this damage. I'm going to walk you guys this way. The wind picking up, so it's no surprise that a tree like this was knocked down in this type of storm. Look how long this tree is. The owner says that it is a Waldra oak. I'm going to bring you guys this way so that you guys can see the snapping of the base right over here. It really just broke this tree. Witnesses say it fell on the power line. Those that were across the street say they heard a loud boom followed by a big flash. The witness describing it as sounding like lightning. Whenever he saw it, he came out here out of the safety of his home to see what was going on. Noticing his power was now out. He said he saw this tree along with another tree that had fallen on top of these power lines and caused the outage. Now we have seen some law enforcement agencies driving the area so that they can secure this area. We also know that there are power companies that have been alerted of the outage. Like I said, it's been a little over an hour that this surrounding neighborhood has had no power. It's unclear, though, how many homes exactly on the street are affected, but we will stay here to try to bring you guys the latest coverage. For now, though, no one was injured when these trees fell, just the power line damage. And like I said, with this wind that is coming, it's no surprise that a tree of this size fell down. For now, reporting live in New Iberia, Hunter Davis, KATC TV3.